art for me has been a very healing journey uh, and it is for many people I know that have gone through very difficult times in their life. Um, there was a period where within five years uh, I was a young mother of two. I lost my own mother to cancer. Um, then three years after that I fled with my children from a bad marriage um, to my hometown where my sister lived that uh, I was very close to and then two years after that she passed away of melanoma cancer. So in a five-year period I went through a horrible difficult time but uh, I seem to be drawn back into art. Manipulating with clay is very pleasing. You can just form whatever you want out of clay. It's, it's a very inspirational thing to be able to create whatever you want. I think you can express yourself completely. Where when you're going through anything uh, traumatic, it's always an inner struggle. No one else can understand what you're going through. But um, I find art, and with me it's clay, you can express all of those feelings in your art. You can express um, so much through it, and it's just really rewarding. This is a better thing to uh, drown your sorrows in than uh, drugs or alcohol or other things that people unfortunately tend to do when they can't cope. I started shows in my backyard for myself and then realized there were so many other artists out there who were kind of hiding in their basement making art that was incredible and they just didn't have the confidence to get out. So I started um, creating shows for other artists and uh, now it's bloomed into something I never expected and it's taken me um, on this incredible journey to helping other artists. We can get through anything, anything at all, the worst of tragedies, and you're gonna make a choice when it, you're going through it. Um, you're either going to, you know, stay in a depression and look at all the negatives and feel like, you know, nothing's ever gonna be good again, or you can look at it in an all-positive way. Always be grateful. That's, that's the only answer I can give you. No matter what you've lost or how little you have or what you've been through, take a look at what you have and work with it. Work with what you have and just, and it'll take you as far as you want to go. You can check out Suzanne's work as well as many other local artists at her upcoming art market in Delburn on Saturday, August 22nd. The event will feature a variety of genres of visual art, fine crafts, and live music.